Hey guys, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls. I had to come out for a uh, feeling sorry for myself coffee frappuccino, even though it is freezing cold out here. Um, and there's not a pretty background. There is, but you can't see it. All you see is a, well, it's kind of blown out in the background. But anyway, I wanted to get on here really quick before I go grocery shopping and then go home and film and talk about my experience shopping for the, that's the straw thing, the Shane Dawson Jeffree Star collaboration. Oh my God. So, mm, delicious. Okay, so what, <laughs> what I did in preparation for this was I emailed all of the customer services. So it was gonna be available on Beautylish, uh, jeffreestarcosmetics.com, and also on morphe.com and I, I'm gonna be traveling. So I'm like, okay, I need to know, like how long is this gonna take, do you think? <laughs> like how much of a backup do you think is gonna happen? And Beautylish got back to me right away and they were like, oh, we're totally ready for this. We'll have it to you in four to five days. And I reiterated, this is the Shane Dawson, Jeffree Star collab for the eyeshadow palette. Like, are you sure? Absolutely. Morphe came back and was like, no, it's going to take a minute. <laughs> it's going to take a couple of weeks for you to get this. Um, I didn't hear back right away from Jeffree Star Cosmetics. As a matter of fact, I had to reach out to them a second time, which it says right there not to do that. But I'm like, I need to figure this out before I get on here, right? Oh, God. Do you guys remember like just a few days ago when we were so young and innocent? I mean, I, a few days ago, thought, oh, I, I think I'm going to have a plan. I'm going to buy this. I'm going to be buying this. and blah, blah. Once I got down to it, it was like, you'll take whatever you can get. <laughs> I mean, it was a madhouse. It was crazy, you guys. So I get on Beautylish. Oh, actually, I emailed Beautylish a couple days before. And I was like, you know, are you guys going to have the bundle? And their response was, we don't know what we're going to be allowed to sell. <sighs> what? <laughs> a day and a half, two days before you don't know what you're going to be allowed to sell? I wasn't sure if I understood what they were talking about. But anyway, I get on Beautylish, I don't even know, like 45 minutes ahead of time. And I, I want to say, I don't remember exactly when it was, but it was like right before the launch. It was before the launch. Before it even happened, Beautylish went down. And uh, <laughs> I was like, oh, this is not good. This is, oh, this is already kind of a hassle. But they had shown what they were going to be selling. And they had a different bundle on there with the two mirrors no lip balm. And I'm like, I want a mirror, but I don't want both of them. Great. And I knew if I got it off the Jeffree Star Cosmetics website, I was going to have to have it shipped to where I was traveling to. And then I was going to have to worry about bringing that all back on the airplane undamaged. So it was crazy, stressful. I'm not even sure if it was worth it. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. I mean, I, they didn't give me a napkin. I mean, I don't want to jump to those conclusions right now. I'm looking for a napkin. Hold on. I mean, it, it was just insane. It was just insane. And I was able to, on Beautylish, I was putting things into my cart. So I ended up getting, um, what is it? The travel, the printed travel makeup bag, a pink pig mirror, and the actual eye palette, the big one. I was able to get that. However, <laughs> the other things that I wanted, like, are you filming, um, the gloss, I had those in my cart and they were getting pulled out of my cart. Listen, I don't know what's going on on the back end, but in my mind, that is never okay. Hype be damned. I don't care. You don't do that. Okay. Would you be okay with somebody coming and ripping it out of my hands if I were in a physical store? I mean, that's crazy. The, why, why is it going out of my cart? You know what I mean? So I wasn't able to get that. I'm actually, this was all through Beautylish and I'm waiting for them to email me and tell me that they can't fulfill my order. <laughs> I'm waiting for it, okay? Like, whatever. Um, so we'll see, but it was a madhouse. The Jeffree Star Cosmetics uh, website went down. Morphe was up a little bit. Morphe w at first was only showing the palette and they didn't have all the stuff. I mean, is good on Shane and Jeffrey. Good for you and congratulations. That's really, really cool. I'm happy for you. But from a consumer standpoint, that was stressful. It, I didn't get what I wanted. It was, it was just like a mad scramble. It was like, just pick a, I felt like I was at a sample sale. Okay. Where you just have to take what you can get. And 
I don't, you know, for as much as this stuff is, I don't love that. You know what I mean? So there was that. So the experience was pretty crazy. And the other thing that I've been sitting on for a long time was when the design of the palette came out. It's called the Conspiracy Palette. I know I'm a spiritual channel. Everybody calm down. <laughs> You know, the conspiracy theorists are a part of our community, whether you love it or don't. And I'm a makeup enthusiast. I'm not really good at it, but I, I like makeup. And so this was of interest to me. However, when they came out with the palette design, it's a pyramid that's missing its capstone. I wonder if Shane and Jeffrey are aware of that. Makes me wonder. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Um, if you don't know what that is, go look it up. Basically, their conspiracy palette is based on a conspiracy, which is very fitting. But I just wonder if they understand that. So, anyway, I thought I would come out and get my... It's freezing cold here. I don't know why I got this. <laughs> I just wanted something cool and creamy. And I was just... It was just, like, really, really stressful to try to get this stuff. And I'm not even sure what I got, honestly. So, I can... Um, definitely, if I can get the palette. I had to have it shipped. Oh, that was the other thing. Sorry. I got to go back. It has to be shipped to where I'm going. Because remember Beautylish, I told you I, I emailed customer service. They came back and said, oh, it'll be there in four to five days. Nope. When I was going through checkout, they're like, oh, it's going to take at least two weeks for us to get this to you. Not even, oh, excuse me, not even get it to me, but to get it processed and ready to ship. <laughs> so that's where I'm like, oh my God, I'm just hoping that it actually makes it there. And now I got to lug that stuff back. So I ended up having to have it sent to where I'm going anyway. So I'm glad I got to be a part of all of this. I think it's cool that I was a part of all of this. It was interesting to be sitting there knowing that Shane was probably freaking out that his stuff was going. It sold out like, like it was nothing to get sold out. And we knew that. We knew that was coming. But again, with the Shane merch, um, think what you will about these people. I don't, I mean, your opinion is your opinion. But the whole pig thing, <laughs> I think is just really funny and adorable. And this is part of pop culture history. And, you know, when the merch came out, that was a genius move on their part because they're, you know, doing the soft launch, you know, testing the business kind of thing. But then I missed out on that too. And then I... You know, I shouldn't complain. I think I got three items, but man, <laughs> what I want is to have a shopping experience where I can pick and choose what I want. You know what I mean? And not have stuff yanked out of my cart or, um, I don't know if this will happen, but maybe even getting an email saying, oh, by the way, we didn't have this in stock. Uh, so anyway, I'm going to have to log all that stuff back on the airplane. I just keep thinking about that. <laughs> So, yeah, I'm just, whatever, I'm going to leave it there. So, I'm going to finish my little drink. I'm going to go grocery shopping, and then I'm going to go home and film. Um, I'm going to be batch filming today, so we'll do that. Then we just got to get on with our lives, right? <laughs> I cannot wait to see what the next series is like, or the next episode in the series is like, and uh, how this was all going for them. But uh, on this end, I don't know. Like, I know people who are younger than me who are probably really okay with it because the hype of it all was pulling them through. I'm too old for that crap. Like I'm not entertained by that. <laughs> I'm not entertained by that. When I, when I want to buy something, I want it to be available and I want it to be a good experience. I, it, this was a bit of a, I don't know. I don't know guys. This was a bit crazy. I mean, all the websites started going down. I thought everyone was prepared with the infrastructure. Like how did it go down? I don't know. And then when the websites would come up, they would kind of show you what was available, but maybe it wasn't available. And then you try to add it to the cart and you get an error message. And it was more stressful than it needed to be. And I know now, <laughs> never worry about buying things initially because they'll restock this. They would be silly not to. They have to restock this, right? So they better because I want that one lipstick shade. So anyway. Enough of that. I'm going to get on with my life. I'm sending you all so much love and take care. Bye-bye.